Last night, the public voted Brian the winner of Big Brother. This is the story of the final week in the Big Brother house, retold with new material. Mm. Excuse me? It's the morning after Paul's eviction. Helen has spent the night sleeping in Paul's bed. The four remaining housemates are starting their ninth week cut off from the outside world. So you believe in, in other forms of life? Sorry? You believe in other life forms? I don't have no idea. I have no idea. There's every chance, isn't there? Yeah. There's every chance. Because infinity is kind of a hard concept to grasp, so you just think, well, it's got to end somewhere. But then, like, well, it's something. pretty wild to think that our sun is one of the smallest stars. Uh-huh. And there's... Billions in our galaxy, yeah. and there's billions of galaxies. Yeah. Now then, how about that? And we've only ever explored ours. <laughs> okay, Helen, should we start? 2:18 p.m. The group have been set their final task. Over the next four days, they'll be tested on how well they've got to know each other. Did he play football? No. Today, they must show how much they know about each other's childhoods. Um, so who's your best friend at secondary school? Oh, I didn't really have, um, I didn't really have one best friend. I had, like, lots of, big group of girlfriends. Okay, so we but don't know about the... any of those, then? No, there's too many. Those. No, I just, I was, I was quite, I was, um, at school I was kind of, um, captain of a lot of sports teams. Oh, yeah. I was captain of hockey, captain of netball, um, of athletics. What were mum's, mum and dad's names? Now. Rosie. Rosie. And Jared. Jared. Yeah. Jared. Jared. Gerald. Jared. 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 G E G E. Not Gerald. No. <laughs> G E A R D. <laughs> Irish names. Jed. Jared. Jared. Think of turd. And it's Jared. Jared. Yeah. <laughs> In six days' time, the housemates will find out who has won Big Brother. Brian is called to the diary room. If I could, if, if, I, if I was to win this, if, if I was to win this, if I, if, if I, if it was, no, I could win this, um, if someone wants to give me the 70 grand, you know, I, I'd take it, but I don't think I'd like to take what comes with it, to be honest. Um, all, all the publicity and, I mean, I think you've got a better chance leaving here um, coming fourth, third, second, whatever you do, and adjusting back to normality quite quickly, you know, just going to your local shop and just being being me. But I think, you know, having, having to win this would, would be kind of scary in a sense because, you, you know, it'd be hard because with the 70 grand, with coming first, I'm sure comes, comes a lot of stuff too that would be harder to handle than just being in the Big Brother house and, you know, being recognised from that. <laughs> Okay, try it. 5.46 p.m. The group are going to be tested on what they've learned about each other's childhoods. No! It's multiple choice, anyway. They'll be questioned one by one in the diary room. You've never Angels to never fail! fail. <laughs> Helen's favourite toy was, A, a dog that wore trousers called Harry, <laughs> a monkey called Mickey that wore gloves, or C, a horse that wore a jumper called Daffid. You must answer one of the three options. <laughs> so you've got no idea there. A dog called Harry, eh? That's right. Harry. 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 Shh. Did I get it right? Yes, you did. You got two. 
It's open, Dean. I know. Oh, sorry, mate. Should we see your hand? Unless they've got that Oh, another. bless okay, him. Let's watch. What was the name of Elizabeth's best friend at school? <laughs> was it A? She didn't have one. Was it B? Jane? Or C? Deborah? It was A. She didn't have one because she was so unpopular. <laughs> Thank you, Dean. You may leave the dollar room. I've got, got more, more tricky oh, ones. I don't know. <laughs> Ryan, Dean, you should. Have to your primary school, yes, yeah? at Mary's and St. Patrick's. Hello, Helen. <laughs> Checks yeah. are bronze. I don't know any. Brian's favourite food as a child was oh, A. Burnt sausages and tomato sauce. B. Soft boiled egg and soldiers. Or C. Vanilla ice cream with warm custard. <laughs> A, burnt sausages with tomato sauce. What is the name of Brian's father? Is it A, Dad. Gerd, B, <laughs> Gerard, or C, Gerd? A, Gerd. Like, I can say something now, but I'm not going to. to Gerd, A, Gerd, Gerd. The housemates pass the first stage of the week's task. Their reward will be all the ingredients for a children's party. <laughs> My Brian, what a clean kitchen. 9.03 p.m. After a dinner of trout and vegetables made by Dean and Elizabeth, the housemates drink cider. Big Brothers provided them with face paint as part of their reward for the task. Oh, my God! You have got demons inside you tonight. Don't look. You're going to be scared when you see... Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ, I'm Eve, I'm Satan. Isn't he? Helen's cute and you... Mm. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Don't look at my face. Cut off, Helen. Oh, he's Come on, sit down, I'm going to finish off you now. Ryan, have you seen your cake? You've got horns uh, on your cake. Do I? Have horns? I'll show you horns. I like <laughs> being pink. <laughs> Keep pleasing, chilly, I am. Sure, pig. I mean, yes, Helen. Four hours later, the conversation turns to Paul's departure. You're right, darling. I'm fine. Are you a bit lovesick? No, I'm fine. Sorry, stuff sick. Why would I be love sick? Stuff sick. I'm not stuff sick either. Okay. Good. I'm absolutely fine. It's weird not having Paul you, I think. That's what I find the weirdest. <laughs> Do anybody ask so, that, that? But that's because you me. spent so much yeah, time with him over the past few days. We didn't spend really much time with him because you two were together all the time. You did spend time with him. Of no, I know. You two were off in the den all the you time. You spent loads of time Honestly, together. Honestly, H, it was basically us three and you two. No, but it felt weird to me when Bubble went and there was that yeah. person I couldn't speak to about That's stuff. That's why I feel yeah, like I know. I can't I'm, I'm thinking about, yeah. About the stuff you used to speak to. Yeah, yeah. stuff yeah. like Steph and just... Mm. Yeah. No, that, Steph takes, Steph. that takes some getting used to, though. That's a special friend you've got. Sure is. Your thing's gone kind of greeny colour. Looks kind of greeny now. What's that, my thing? But Shiny no. green, your face. My face. I'm definitely not live sick and I'm definitely not stuff sick. I'm just sick. missing a friend. Yeah. Ten eighteen AM. Dean and Brian are still asleep. Tea bags and coffee. Garlic. G A R L I C. Elizabeth and Helen write the housemates' final shopping list. Because the group failed last week's task, they have just £21 to spend. 75. 26. P. 26. We've got 15, 26. Um, that's five bottles of cider. Mm. Go on, try it. 1.08 p.m. Elizabeth is making tomato soup for lunch. <laughs> That's 
kind of weird, isn't it? Tang. Sugar. Mmm. That would be my antidote fruit. If it was orange soup, it might be all right. Or orange and tomato Call soup. Call it orange and tomato soup, then. <laughs> Oh, well. For the second stage of their task, each member of the group must sculpt another housemate's head using clay. But don't Elizabeth get angry with me. That's the thing. Brian and Elizabeth have chosen each other as subjects. Yeah. Helen has chosen to do Dean's head, and Dean has chosen to do Helen's. Helen could surprise us. She might just be a sculptor. Can you imagine she pulled out this fantastic thing? She, for a hairdresser, she's not that really. She surprises me sometimes. I got a serious problem going on here with Dean's nose. <laughs> well, I won't give you any help because I have two. This yeah. looks too, too masculine. Well, guys, I'm glad you could come. All right, hi. hi. Big Brother has provided champagne and canapes for the presentation of the housemates' work. The subjects of each sculpture will unveil their own heads. Let me just take a cup of champagne. Very excited. Oh. What's it like, Dean? <laughs> guys? He is a good Brian. I like the ears. Which one are you? I think she's doing really well. I think she actually. I, think, I look like Mr. Potato Head. Oh, you love it. Thank you, Sweetie. Mwah. 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 One, two, three, grand opening. Elizabeth by Brian. Wow, it looks nothing like, like me, but I actually all. really like it. You're just pouting. I think Elizabeth will be interested in seeing this. Da, 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 da. Da, da, da. It's a blow. Oh, it's a blow. It's such a blow. It's chubby cheeks. Oh, my God, I look like my dad! <laughs> 9.30pm. With five days to go, Big Brother calls Elizabeth to the diary room. Why not? No, depending on the words being hysterical. Because kind of the end is in sight. Maybe we're all starting to think more about our own lives after this, our own friends and our family. So maybe sometimes I feel that it's maybe more individuals. Um, and then we get together as, as a group sometime. So it's quite relaxed. The house feels big. And I think people are thinking kind of more of Friday than the moment. But the tasks are really good. <laughs> One fifty-seven a.m. Brian goes to bed. Helen is already asleep. At the moment, I'm beginning to feel like the most boring person on this earth. Bo B O R I N G. Yeah, you know. Why? Just because it's like. I think everyone's a bit prone to that. Yeah, I think you're just a bit jaded. I'm afraid. And you've been filming for 24 hours a yeah. day for nine weeks. Yeah. Because I thought that uh, about a week ago. Oh, am I doing enough? Is it interesting enough to be? Am I interested? She's like, oh, I'm just me. And give me nothing to do and I'll do nothing. Give me something to do and I'll do something. Mm. You know, I'll give as much as I get kind of thing. And if that comes across as boring, I'll, I'll stand by that. He was boring, fine. <laughs> Along with my colleagues in the cabin today, Brian, Helen and Dean, we should be taking good care of you en route to Bo. Do you think it's right to smack your child? Yeah. So do I.
It's the last Monday in the Big Brother house. Helen's made the porridge. <laughs> Dean? Yeah, you've burnt you it. You know you want to grow big and strong. Yeah. Get that down your neck, then. <laughs> Bloody hell, love. a huge bowl of porridge. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. It's true that my small one is probably the normal size bowl. Nominations would be today, wouldn't they? Yeah, it's so nice that there's not. Oh. 12.49 p.m. <coughs> it's got better this week than you did last week, Brian. Yeah, much better. It's the last week you won yourself, was you? At all. I was just so pissed off at being here and I was just so, oh, I just wanted to go. Because we'd seen so many people go, do you know what I mean? Yeah. And then... It was after when Josh went, wasn't it? Yeah, and I was like, oh, I just want to go. And then the prospect of him being in the same place as my friends would be. Mm. And then seeing him and me being stuck in here, and I'm like, oh. Were you cold last night? Hey. You cold? Am I cold? Last night, in bed. Was I? No, no. I was so cold. I didn't really know Paul that well, to be honest. Why? Just don't know. I don't think we ever really had that much in common. We didn't tell him at all. Didn't you? No. We're from different backgrounds. We're brought up differently. Yeah, but he's not horrible to talk to, is he? Oh, God, no. He's not horrible to talk to, don't get me wrong. We just never really... The only people I've ever really clicked with in here. Penny, Narinda, Bubble, Dean, Elizabeth, you. Two twenty nine PM. All four housemates are in the garden. Yeah, to dissect a rat in a dog fish at school. You to dissect a rat? Yeah. I never I would refuse to do it. What is that? We never fish? done it. It's a fish. They've got a monkey fish. You're not scared of rats? Mm, I'll jump if I see it, but it's dead. It's pickled in a vacuum bag. And it's cut it open. Nice yeah. and fresh, Brian. You sickle. I told you about the woman who said them coming up through the toilet. Yeah. What year was this? This was decade. really, yeah. They were coming up to the toilet. 90s. Really? Yeah. And she sat on it. A us. baby, you know. What, got? Yeah, got by rats. Oh. Got eaten by rats. Mm. That poor baby. That's nasty, that is. That poor child. Yeah. It, that's not a sign of evil. Taking the life of an angel. <laughs> Those birds are annoying me. If they came down and picked at us, they'd kill us. Excuse me? If birds came down and picked at us, they'd kill us. Two at the front. One left. One left. And one right. One right. And then go like that. The housemates have been set the third stage of their final task, designed to test how well they know each other. Hey. Yeah. Today, each housemate must teach another their job or skill. With, no, with this hand. OK. Just press harder with this one. Dean, who used to be in an indie band, must teach Helen to play three chords on the guitar. Okay. All you've got to do is that. Please what? Study these. Study these before, before, before departure. Yeah. Brian, an air steward for three years, has to teach Elizabeth to perform an airline safety demonstration. I'll it's say it and you do it. My name is Elizabeth. Along with my colleagues in the cabin today, Brian, Helen, and Dean, we should be taking good care of you en route to Bow. Total flying time is one hour. Four hours later, the housemates have been given outfits to perform what they've been taught. This is Big Brother. Good housemates. Uh, the next hey, you've done it, Helen! Hey, I'm just right. getting into it! I'm not gonna get my right. You will, you'll pull your back jacket over. Keep it The team is alright! Yeah, perfect. It's really great. The look. Okay, come on. <laughs> Can I, I sit here to prompt? Yeah. 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 I don't think I can get it over my head. Mm. 
Okay. This is Big Brother. Could Elizabeth please begin her safety demo? Big breath. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome on board this Boeing 747 flight to Bow. There are eight emergency exits on the plane, all indicated by a red sign above them. In the unlikely event of a landing in the sea, you'll find this life jacket underneath your seats, placed like so, over your head. To attract more attention, should you have problems, you have a light and a whistle. The cabin crew and myself will now pass through the cabin, making sure that your tables are upright, your blinds are down, your seat belts are fastened, and your seats are upright. Thank you very much for your attention, and enjoy your flight. Could you just touch yeah. it? Thank you. Thank you. I'll just take my own seat. Dean's had lessons in cutting and styling hair from Helen, a professional hairdresser. Amazing, so. Dean, that's fantastic. Feels great. God, almighty. You've done it. it yeah. Is it good? I think that it was the top. Feels fantastic. I think it was the top that fantastic. did it. Fantastic. Cool. <laughs> Guys, where am I? Where am I dancing? <laughs> Elizabeth. Elizabeth who's taken flamenco lessons, has spent the afternoon coaching Brian to dance for 30 seconds. Right, oh, right, confidence, shoulders Stretch. back. And wait Shut for up. the music. Wait for it. Yeah. Do you think I think we're pulled too much? Then? Yeah. No, not in here, but I think when you leave here, you shouldn't really focus. I won't though, but I just come in you, innit? Uh... Karen, I'm gonna kill that little fucker now. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Brian, I got your question now. Quickly. Do you think it was more that I fancy Paul than Paul fancied me? No, not really. I think it was 50 50. Do you think so? I think, but you just, how you felt it a bit more than Paul did. Oh. Get in, Brian. Brian, it's Tuesday. It is. Next day's Wednesday. Thursday, Friday. Oh, dear me. Twelve nineteen p.m. The group have been given the final stage of their task. Today, housemates must learn more about each other's views on morality and politics. Oh, you may read that. I'm like, uh, uh, morality. Morality. Do you know? Yeah, politics and morality. Show your lines, Helen. Oh yeah. Would you shoplift? No. The group must spend the next four hours finding out each other's opinions. Do you think it's right to smack your child? Yeah. So do I. Uh, I don't know. Just a little, like, tap, yeah, dummy. Yeah, just a smack, yeah. Oh, just a smack? Yeah, not beat the shit oh, out of it. a smack is OK, yeah. Mark spent slippers when he used to do it with. Backs of my legs. I used to get smacked when I was naughty and I deserved it as well. <laughs> what about abortion? It's kind of becoming quite easy to Too get easy. rid of. of babies. To get rid, it's kind of quite easy, kind of recreational sex. Oh, I forgot to wear a condom. It's becoming long. Um, I'm just going to go into shop and buy the morning after pill.
1.53 p.m. Big Brother calls Helen to the diary room to ask about the task. We discuss certain issues. We still need to discuss more, I think. But um, it's all sort of like down to knowing people. And even though we have been living together for nine weeks, I don't think we still really know each other that well. This is Big Brother. Could all housemates please come to the lounge area? Here we go, guys. Five or six p.m. The group Here are about the to be tested. They'll face multiple choice questions in the diary room about another housemate's morality or politics. Each housemate must get one answer right for the group to pass. Does Helen believe the royal family should be abolished? Yes or no? OK. H, is it no? I don't think they should. So. No, she doesn't. Yeah, that's right, isn't it? Thank yeah. you, Brian. You may leave the diary room. <laughs> Does Brian believe that cannabis should remain illegal for everyone? Yes. That's easy. He believes he, it should remain illegal for everyone, so yes. Yes, that's right. That's easy. How am I going to feel? Elizabeth's bound to get me. No, H, I'm not. Do I look nice on TV? Do I look bronzed? You look very bronzed, Brian. Do I look bronzed? Yeah, you look very yeah. bronzed. Does Brian believe that smoking in public places should be banned? Oh, I think he wants it to be banned, but... And say no, he doesn't think it should be banned. If Dean had a chance to go back in time and kill Hitler as a child without anyone finding out about it, yes, he would. would he do it? Yes, he would. You got me right! You got you right! Yes! yes! I thought, did you say, I said yes. And Tony oh, said, you, you said, it's all you said Brian didn't then. like it, but he wouldn't ban it. I said, it. I said, because it's, it's established and he just yeah, wouldn't change the rules. Did I get you right? No. I said he would too. I you thought you would. Would you kill a child, even if it was Hitler? Have you got it in you to go back and kill a child? But you knew it was Hitler. Would you, though? This is Big Brother. I poisoned yeah. you on me. I didn't really think about it. Yeah. I just thought... Oh, my God, here I go. Helen's the last yeah. to go. She has to get one of her answers right for the group to pass the task. Hello, Big Brother. She looks lovely on TV. Holiday, woman. If a good friend of Brian's was claiming social security while on a good wage at the same time, would Brian try to persuade them to stop claiming it? Well, I would, and Brian thinks a bit like me, and honesty is always okay. I think he would definitely, yes, he would try and stop them claiming it, trying to sway them and stop them. Yes, I think he would, because I would, and I think Brian always thinks that the truth, uh, yes. like. <laughs> Thank you, Helen. You I'm may leave the here. diary room. She's gone. Yeah. yeah. Oh. See, I knew I would. Never mind. Doesn't Don't matter. worry about it. Doesn't matter. But I did really think, though. Yeah. I know. That's why you got two wrong. My one, I said. What? Yeah. 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 You got me. 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 You got Elizabeth and Helen go to bed. Dean and Brian are still up. The housemates have just 72 hours left in the Big Brother house. anymore. This is Davina. Shit! Oh my live on Channel 4, so please don't swear. Oh my god! <laughs> 
11.10 a.m. Helicopters. Yeah. They went over. And the guys were out the windows like that. Oh, were they waving? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, that's fantastic. Thanks, I mean, but abroad, I always use it. Big Brother has decided to surprise the remaining housemates by evicting one of them tomorrow night. They won't be told until an hour and a half before the eviction happens. From the good news or the bad news? Why? Good news is there's no bad news. Oh. OK, fantastic. Congratulations on your contribution to the Big Brother experience. Oh, no. To mark the last week of your stay in the Big Brother house, you'll be given a gourmet meal of your choice tomorrow night. Tomorrow night! Ah! We're all here. We're all here till Friday. Friday. With your meal, Big Brother will provide you with an extremely fine vintage wine. Oh, no. Can we have chips in the chip shop? Absolutely. <laughs> no. Not. <laughs> Anyone ever heard of the word discombobulated? Yeah. No. You have, Dean? Yeah. What does it mean? Out of sorts. Ooh, I've never heard of that word before. Does it work in context? Discombobulated. What? Does out of sorts work in context? Yeah, it does, yeah. Yeah. You've probably been in magazines as well, can't you? Do you think? I'll just leave them. Guess. No one's going to read them. Unless it's a souvenir for someone. Yeah. It's now five days since Paul was evicted. I couldn't imagine you and Paul getting in on immediately. Could I? No. Then again, I could with you, though. You'd be like, come on. You would. You'd be gacking. I don't want to talk about this, OK? You'd be ravenous. Because you do fancy him, don't you? Yeah. And he fancies you. I don't know. He just likes personality. Yeah, how rude. How bold is that? I like your personality. OK, then. I wouldn't say you attacked his tackle, did you? Who knows? You don't know, Brian. <laughs> 8 11 p.m. As a reward for passing their final task, the housemates have been offered a choice of themed parties. They've chosen The Last of the Mohicans. I'll have that then. There you go, Brian. I'll have this then. The sheriff can't dress like that, can he? He's the only one left. I'm being the big chief. Dean, we get guns! You're fantastic. You Fine, we can have cheeseburgers. Helen? Bitch! Dean, it's not working. They're heavy. They're probably extinguished. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Brian, that buffalo is just like steak. I don't want any buffalo. It's just like steak, Brian. On the menu for the housemates' party are Native American delicacies, buffalo, venison and dove. This burger, bollocks, yeah. tongue, Eyeballs. eye, brain, ears. Oh. Elizabeth, attempt to shut up, please. He's upsetting oh. me dreadfully. Who's speaking the truth? Put one by there, friend. Oh, evil. Dove is a bird, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Mm, the white one, the sign of peace. Mm. Mm. Not in this house. Who will leave the Big Brother house first? Oh, it's not fun anymore. I was so... You could see me being spoiled, couldn't you? Yeah. Yeah. <gasps> I have seen you being spoiled. In the water, look! No, no. No, no. That would scare me, a baby shark. 
I'd scream if I seen that now. If I was there, as in a pool. That size. I would scream. I'd be like, ah, amphibian. <laughs> <laughs> In 12 hours' time, one of the four housemates will be evicted. All of them still believe they'll be spending the last two days in the house together. Can't wait to see Vanessa, dude. I can't wait to see her. Mate, I'm not, she's not getting out of my sight for, for ages. Literally, she's not going to work or anything. No way. Oh, my God, I gotta see my mother. She'll be so happy to see you, mate. She'll be so proud of you, you know. I know, she will be. She went off. It must have been hard for Brian to walk in without his parents, I think. Mm hmm. He hadn't told them he was gay. It's all a lot for them to deal with in one go, that is. Yeah. How could your mum or dad not know you were I gay? I know! How could they not know? How could they not know? He's so... Gay. Gay, it's unbelievable. You just look at him, wouldn't you, and go, you're gay? Definitely. Just by the belts. Twelve twenty-six p.m. Big Brother plans to spring the eviction surprise on the housemates in six hours' time. <laughs> yep, delicious. Cool. Day sixty-three, Brian. Can you believe it? Not really. Me either. But it's here. When they're all done, do you can just give us a shout? Mm. Or you could just serve them all up with, you know, sugar and syrup and we get all that. Probably do that, yeah. Yeah. Bubba's gone a month tomorrow. Penny's gone seven weeks. Seven weeks. Noreen just gone five weeks. That's amazing, seven weeks. Stuart's gone six weeks. It's just gone a month and a half. Amazing. It's a bit evil, all right. Three forty four PM. Elizabeth is called to the diary room. It's kind of now because there's so little time left. Uh, a lot of moments are special, the way you look at things, the way, you know, like tonight's going to be the last sunset that I see in here. Last night was the last meal we cooked together. Um, today, no, we might have porridge tomorrow. Just silly things like that. The last thing of this, the last thing of that. So just kind of savouring those, really. <laughs> Evil weather. The evil weather is upon us. Oh, I like this. It's nice and cool. Not for these sun worshipping fiends. <laughs> we want the weather. Helen. I know. Sleeping ass. Really? Like a necklace got a big on. Big white triangle. I'll bronze it tomorrow, Brian. Yep. Yeah. It's my double chin. Isn't a it? line on your tit as well. Yeah, it's a while. Okay. She's seen last night with the bikini top off. Brian, then just look at bloody that. hell! Look. But and and those shorts that you yeah, yeah, like, yeah. invisible shorts that you're wearing. Bloody hell. Fucking hell, dude. Hope your dress has come as high as those shorts. It does. Oh, Helen. Oh. I don't believe your dress. It, it comes up to oh, I don't know. It comes up. To. It doesn't. You're gonna see your big white legs. Oh, bronze that bit. Don't worry about it, Brian. If you're sunbathing in your bikini the whole time, you'd have a tan all over you. Yes. Yeah, but then I splurge across and I get like. Mm. No, but the thing is, people are seeing you in your bikini, people are seeing you naked in here, so. What? The big what deal? Yeah, who, who were you trying to. What's for? You were in front well, of Paul in anyway. your bikini in the jacuzzi. I know, but I was a bit conscious, do you know what I mean? Oh. Grazie. Bloody what hell. Is, it? is that chicken? It looks amazing. God, it must have taken half an hour to cut it that way. Yeah. The group believe they will all be leaving the house tomorrow. Big Brother has not told them that their gourmet meal is their last supper together. Mm. Chilies, yeah, they're not peppers. Asparagus, Elizabeth? Yeah. Oh, wow. Mm. That's fantastic. How fancy is it, Dean? Mm. Um, I, I fancy it. Mm. What is this? Eating soup. What's that red thing? Eat it. Find oh, out. Might make me sick. Yeah, that's the idea. 
Mmm. And there's like a leaf or something in the middle of your chicken. Oh, that is fancy. That's spinach. What do you think the stuffing is, Elizabeth? Mmm, there's something hot in it. Mmm, wait me. It's lemony, I thought. Mmm, type is that time then? I don't know. Bloody hell, this is fantastic. It is stonking, isn't it? Yeah. It's, and it's interesting because you don't Yeah, very. In fact, mm -hmm. words fail me. Slimy. It's different. Oh, do you And I'm like enjoying it. it. It's very tasty, yeah. isn't it? I just don't want to know what it is. It's dove. Uh, don't, I won't eat it. It's a potpourri of flavours, Brian. Phew, it's making me even hotter. As I imagined it would be. This makes it worthwhile for staying for week nine. Oh, I think all of week nine. I was going to say all of this week. Yeah. Yes. This week's been really Betty. good. Better. Better. Right. gone. Mm, I felt that. Thank you, though. Two bottles of wine last Thursday, there's five of us here. After dinner, the group discuss whether Big Brother might be planning to give them more alcohol. Remember? Oh, we had bottles, yeah. Get up early tomorrow, you want to lie in. I am not getting up early tomorrow. Because you're going to have a late night, aren't you? Yeah, and I'm telling you guys. Big Brother House, this is Davina. Shit! Oh, my... You're live on Channel 4, so please don't swear. Oh, my God! Could you please gather in the now? Someone's area. leaving, guys. Oh, oh my, my God! God. My my hair! A dog killing, chicken hating puff <laughs> will not win this. You inside your cups? Oh no, one's just come out. Oh, one's just bought, popped out the thing. We know who's got to go. Big Brother has surprised the housemates by announcing that one of them will be evicted in an hour and a half. Oh my God, I Drink these knocker There's only going to be three of us here tonight. I don't really like that. That won't be so good, but never mind. I am shaking. Give me your hand. Okay, Big Brother House, this is Davina. Yeah. Hello, Davina. Mm. Take the off my shoes. Who they want to win. The person with the least number of votes oh will be evicted tonight. Oh my God. I now reveal that the eighth person Fine. to be evicted from the Big oh, Brother House will be Elizabeth. I knew it would be. Oh my God! I knew it would be. Oh. Elizabeth! Oh, okay. Colin, I'm done. Sit down. Come here, sweetheart. Because in hell in your hair is fine. Oh my god, my hair. That's just typical of a hairdresser to say that though, isn't it, Brian? Yeah, it's your job. Oh my god, my hair. I could not have gone out looking like this. Mm, I've got to deal with the hysteria on my own. <laughs> that I don't appreciate. Just think how it was tonight. Time's ten. Uh huh. I kind of. Don't envy you being here after I go, actually. No, she's... However, it's just... It is just a level of hysteria. Yeah, it's just like, chill out. It's hysteria, I was about to say to H. If you don't sit down now, I'm going to throw a glass of cold water on you or hit you. To calm you down. Yeah. Thank you. You too. Nice to meet yeah. you. Yes, we'll be there. Don't forget to wear a vodka wrap on. Okay. After 63 days in the house, Elizabeth returns to the outside world. Bye-bye! Oh, see you tomorrow. Bye, darling. See you tomorrow, darling. I'll see you tomorrow, babe. Get over there. You got a wolf. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Something, music, oh, that, something or something. Something like no. that. And then 
there and was three. And then there was three. three. Do you think they knew this, but was going all along? So and they know now the roughly who's going to win. There's a whole day tomorrow. A whole day of tomorrow voting. There's could a whole day. Yeah. Right. The viewers are going to see nothing though. All the whales could wake up and vote for her. Tomorrow I'd morning. They probably think I'll vote for her. Forget it. A dog killing, chicken hating puff <laughs> will not win this. <laughs> so just so you all know that. <laughs> a black man from Birmingham might. No. Or a Welsh hoggy wog hairdresser. What do you reckon? A gobby Welsh girl hairdresser with blonde who flirts with a bloke in you. Loud and annoying, she's very right. Loud and annoying, which people like you to find me. Yeah, but you haven't been put out there loud and annoying. That hasn't been you. Four including You're tonight. gonna be the a lovely brummy. the lovely the lovely sensitive Welsh girl next door who found love maybe in here, perhaps. That's the winning vote, Dredd. Done. Isn't Me it? and you are fighting for second and third. Yeah. I don't want to win it just because you're gay and just because you're black. Shut up! If I won 70 grand, I'd shut my mouth and do with the fucking jack. He's black. You're a Welsh girl. I'm in the spare. Whatever there, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> 12 a.m. It's Brian, Dean and Helen's last night in the Big Brother house. Dean is the only one still awake. <clears throat> Look out there. Paul. Paul. Shit, you're not Paul. No, you're Brian. Brian. He's going first. Day 64, the last day in the Big Brother house. For fuck's sake. In 14 hours time, the winner of Big Brother will be revealed. The group's suitcases have been delivered so they can start packing. Right, I've got a present for you, love. Is that a name on it? Yeah. Show me. Oh. Oh. Do you want to get your sweet dinner on yourself? No, I want you to get them. They're fantastic! Though you're tired and weary, still journey on at the end of the room. It's rehearsal time, Helen. Because I, I sort of do sort of like lean to the side, I do, don't I? I lean a little bit no, too. No, drag it, Helen. I know, I can't. Here we we'll do it, I'll show you. Carry it, don't have much in there. Oh, OK. Push it down. I'm going to carry it. Don't know by carrying it. Why? I think I might want something to hold on to. It looks a bit. Just look a bit bent. It looks a bit more. Ga <laughs> looks a bit more macho carrying it. <laughs> Sleeping with Vanessa tonight. Absolutely, mate. Catching up for lost time. That's a good one. But in, I know I've been really horny. And if I had a party when I get out, I think I don't think I would in the night. You won't. I won't tonight. You won't. No you just be so like, oh. There's no way. Probably a snog and a cuddle. Yeah, but there's no way. And in the morning, that's a little bit different. That'll be very different, I imagine. Do you not disturb on the door? But it's not, it's not going to get nasty tonight. Nasty. Nasty tonight. Nasty. 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 It's not going to get Not like at that. all. I just wanted to get moving. Imagine being here if you're the last one in this house on your own for half an hour. Have you any idea how long that half an in hour In the diary? Would you not want to see someone? I don't know what I'd do. I can't oh. imagine. I'd do Tai Chi, just keep doing it. Gene's do gone mad. Over and over again. <laughs> 3.24pm. 
The housemates have been up for five hours. So far, all Brian and Helen have had to eat is an ice lolly each. Evil. Here we go. Then I'm tested. The last meal has been prepared. Should we now eat, yeah? Yeah. On their last day, the housemates have been allowed an unlimited supply of hot water from 4pm onwards. We've got a long night ahead with Helen. Oh. It's quite draining. Yeah. Don't you think? I'll step in, I'll be, I can keep it her in It is quite draining. She's just like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just like, you've got to just chill. She's going to get she's gonna get ready too early and she's going to get hot and sweaty. Yeah, there. she is, but this point is telling her. I don't know why she's getting ready so early. It's going to make her really impatient. Do you know what I mean? It's going to make her start going... Oh. It's yeah, nothing I'm worse than standing there ready. Yeah, I'm going to start packing shortly. Now I've got that to do, I'm just going to probably chill. And take your time as well. Now that I know there's constant hot water, You've and got... that we're not set till five. Like you say, you can have a shower at seven. 7.49pm. The boys have started getting ready. Show us love. Stunning. This rise enough to get on now. Oh my god. You inside your cups? Oh no, one's just come out. Oh, one's just popped pop out the thing. Which we'll makes you keep not. I mean, it's not secured in, it's okay. just packed with... Oh no, it might fall out. He told me not to bring my shoes out there. Oh no, why not? Trauma! Don't the other one. won't even notice it. Where is it? Look, it's there's the net. Helen, I can't even notice it, and I would. Look, that boob is not the same shape as that boob now. That boob is like that. It's a yeah. permanent. Yeah, there is. I mean, it's where this came out, it's a matter for someone in the car. Shows. Was the sewing kit? It's um, beside it. Show me. Do you know what I mean? I might just like to sew it up it. Put your boot, is your yeah. boot inside it? Yeah, but I might just like to Get a pin. So... Take it with a pin. Yeah. It's outside. Quick, get me a pin then. Oh, go on, let me go back. Yeah, it's all good. I'll brush my tight. <laughs> Eight forty pm In a few minutes' time, Davina will make the evening's first eviction announcement. I gotta check out in the mirror, Brian, as well. Yeah, me too. You mirror junkies. Okay, you pair. Music is played. Can't hear the crowds outside. Five minutes, guys. Cool. Oh. What's the open to in my house? Oh, Davina, come on. What are you, what's keeping you? Do you want any guys, for me? No. no. Look, I'm wearing black. Do you want some tight cheating? Touch cheats no. a few moves. Oh, all right. It's all right. It's all right. I can't see your moves. Just do something. I've, I've got me. You have to get off of this stuff. Eight fifty two PM. What's the matter, guys? Hey, Hi, Hi, Davina! This week the nation has been voting for the person that they want to win the Big Brother. It is now time to announce the name of the person who has come third. Here we go. The ninth person to be evicted from the Big Brother yes. house mm -hmm. will be
Thing. Yes! Oh, oh my god, Brian, we're gonna be last. Me and you. Well, well done! Yeah, you're gonna see Vanessa! Woo! Thing, you can put it down the big of the house. You now have one minute. I won't, no, 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 glitter, glitter. Mm -hmm. Bye. I don't want to cover you in glitter lips. Cool, yeah. All right, I'll give you a hair glitter. Nice okay? and calm, yeah, you yeah, too. We'll be okay. fine, yeah. honestly. Yeah. Don't worry about it. Go on, have a good time. Nice and calm. Yeah, have, thanks to be thank you. Have a good time. Thank you. Have a good time. Dean, I won't hug you because my glitter level. I'll give you a hug later. I don't want you covered in glitter. Come Vanessa! On. Me! Here we go. I'm not second. No, I'm second. Yeah, it. Whatever. No. I have not. Eight, seven, seven six. See you soon. Yeah, you will. See you soon. See the bar. You finished third. Get boosted. Have a nice time with Vanessa. Go, Dean! Go, Dean! See you in a few minutes. No. no. What we got to do is it's, stay calm. He was more worried about us being all right. Bless his little cotton socks. I love him. Well, H, we know where we stand here. Nine weeks after the original ten people entered the Big Brother house, either Brian or Helen will win the £70,000 prize. Brian, good luck. You too, love. I'll see you too, so anyway, and we'll go shopping Thursday, all right? Helen, I'll see you um, in a few minutes. I know, I know, but you know. No matter what, I said Happy this Happy Nicks, what? shopping. Brian and Helen. Hi, Hi Davina. Davina! How are you? Hello. All right, thanks for asking. <laughs> oh, so. <laughs> Of Big Brother 2001. Okay. Okay. In that time, could you please feed the fish? Yes. Oh, you're oh right, my God, the fish! The stove is turned off. What the was that, Sammy? Now that the stove's turned off. Is the stove on? Okay. Uh, yeah. Now... Sorry. Oh, sorry, we. we... Okay. Bye. 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 That means we've got to turn the pump off and, and turn fish. it back. No, and turn it on in 10 minutes because if one of us goes with that, do you know what well, I mean? She's going to announce the winner in 20 minutes. So the winner. She's going to announce the winner. Could I please have some silence? I'm now going to announce the winner. Big Brother House, this is Davina. Can you hear me? Yes, yes, we can. Are you both packed and ready to go? We're yes. ready to rumble. Brian and Helen, you are the last two housemates. Yay. Over seven million people have voted. That's a good, that's a good the phone lines are now closed. The nation has decided. The person in second place has 2,680,000 votes. And the winner has 4,230,000 votes. So I can now reveal that the winner of Big Brother 2001 is... Come on, Davina! Brian! Helen, 
You have finished second. Please leave the Big Brother oh, house. I'm going out now. No, I'm not staying in here. I'm so <laughs> Paul Clark. Paul Clark, you look so you? different. <laughs> well done, well done, Ivan. You look so different. I so much, you would not believe. You look so different. You're right. I'm fine, because I'm fine. Let me get my shoes up. I want to leave. I want to see Keith. He better be single. I'll tell him that tonight. So if Keith is single, This is a dream. This has to be a dream. I'm going to wake up tomorrow. And I'm going to... I'm going to... <clears throat> see my cases in my hotel room. You look different in real life. Oh, guys, I really want to go. Please let me out of this house. Please, please, please. Oh, for God's sake. I want to go. I'm getting really impatient. that you stayed in that long? Yeah! Were you? My God, yeah! Um, I didn't even think I was going to get in there at all in the house. I was just like, oh my God, I can't believe I've got him. I'm just for these 10 minutes. And I'm... Um, like, You're not disappointed that you kind of just No, so not at all, because and... to me it's like a dancing competition. To all of us, to me, we're all winners when we've all walked in the house. And, and, yeah. and if that, to me, it's like a dancing competition. Was it quite odd seeing Paul Clark? He looks so much younger. He looks younger. <laughs> he looks really nice. Did he? he looked really nice. He's right there if you oh, want to say hello again. Sure. <laughs> now listen, um, you um, were going out with somebody when you were in the house. Mm, and that, that man to be was called Big G. Well, I kind of have to bring it up because we've been dying to talk to you about it for the last two and a half weeks. Because actually, mm. Big G quite publicly said that he didn't want to see you anymore. That's cool, um, I mean. Which was... <laughs> Papers, which we thought you might feel like that um, and carry on with the, the headlines now. Do you feel all right about seeing that though? Yeah, you're I feel okay. bad. I'm like, yeah, whatever, mate. Yeah. Yeah. And let's just show you a oh, little bit no. of your beautiful love story and how it <gasps> completely enthralled the nation. Just to, just to rekindle that fire, take a look at this. Oh no, another fire. You are already coming, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> I do fancy Helen, and it's purely weird because I fancy Helen's personality. Oh. It's like all these oh lights, like we're in parts. Oh, wow. It's like, <laughs> do you feel relaxed? You do. You're not worried about stuff, man. Sure. Hi. 
very sweet. Do you still see the lights? Well, the lights? I was just sort of like disgusted. I didn't have a chance to see the stuff then. I was just like, woo, but I'm sure I will see the stuff. Yes, well, I'm sure you'll be seeing it's, stuff. It's whether Mr. Stuff, Clark will see the stuff. stuff. <clears throat> Mr. Clark. Helen, Helen, I can see the stuff. Thank God. Are you happy that Brian's won? Yeah, I can't, can't believe he's won. Why, do you, really why happy. do you think he's won? What is it about Brian? That... He's a funny guy, he's really nice, and he's got a big heart, he's kind, and overall he's just like really, really, really funny. And every day I've laughed at Brian since I've been in the house, every single Catch day. Catch you saying. Before we go, um, Paul has got something that he wants to give to you. Uh, Paul, yeah, 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 yeah. if you'd like to get the gift and bring it up to um, Helen. What is it? Okay. Up your hands. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my God! <laughs> open, open. Oh, Clark, I can't believe you. Oh my God. Okay, it's a lot oh of stuff from Gucci. Oh my God! He's oh embossed. Oh my God! God. He knows about the That's G's. That's very, very... He knows about the, the G's. G's. He did very well, that's all well done. Oh, my um, God, Paul Clark, I can't look, believe. Hang on, look, I'm just going to quickly open this one because she's too overexcited. Oh, my um, God! <laughs> look, the carry bag. Look, you know, we've got to keep the carry bag. bag. Sorry, sorry. Carry your bags. Look, look, no, but wait. We keep them. Look, look. <gasps> oh, my God! I'm actually quite jealous there. She's got a gorgeous handbag and shoes. Paul from the bathroom because I'm going to take you outside. Okay. Because okay. everyone wants to say. Can I take my handbag? You can take your handbag. With you. Hang on. Oh my lip gloss. Well I want done. my lip Paul, gloss in there. Did Paul not do well there? Paul is. Words fail me. He did fail very well me. indeed. Come on, Helen. Show everybody your handbag. Here she is, runner-up to Big Brother 2001, the magnificent and fabulously stylish. Big Brother House, this is Davina. Davina, thank you. Brian. Yes? Guess what? I'm going. You are the winner of Big Brother 2001. <laughs> and I'm coming to get you. You come and get me. Countdown. Open the door. <laughs> Hi, Richard, Chris, Mom, Dad, everyone. 20 seconds. Oh, Christ. I'm going. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Brian, you have won. Please leave the Big Brother house. Nasty, nasty words. I don't know. Tears, I think. Yeah, I'm okay. Yeah, I'm very shocked. I'm very shocked. Okay, that was your bridge at Absolutely. Brian, yes. can you hear the people? I can. I hear them. I think they need to see Here we you. go. Okay, Let's I see take Brian to the people. He's coming, everybody. Here Just we go. Him, I have no idea. I, I'm so... Just look at that.
I'm very... You just so didn't expect to get this far, did you? No, I, I never expected to. I, I never, I never expected. <laughs> Brian, yes. was it nice seeing your mum and dad? Yeah, I'm, I'm very happy to see mum and dad. They were the um, ones you most wanted to see. I'm probably going to get upset, so I'm not, there's my mum and my dad, everyone. Richard. Rosie, Rosie got on a plane. She got on a plane, my mum got on a plane! And they are so proud of you, and I know that you were very worried before you went in the house. Yeah, I was very worried. That, that you'd come out just before you'd gone in, and you were yeah. worried that they might judge you. But I can tell you right now that your parents love you so much. Uh, oh and they're so, Michelle. so proud of you. And that's your sister, Michelle. Best friend Michelle from home. And Michelle from home. Hello. It's kind of a bit too much to be interviewing you now, isn't it? What's I mean, that? it's almost too much to be interviewing you now with this atmosphere yeah, and I, everything. It's but just you, I'm sorry. Too no, I don't have to apologise. It's just so much to take in. Yes. You know, they, they love you. They love you. This is just, it's, I never expected any of this. Well, like, they I, love I, never, you. I never expected to get it. And from the minute you walked in the house, really? from the minute you walked in the house, Listen, what was your high point of being in the house? My high point um, being in the house was probably just coming in and initially just, just being me and people accepting me for who I was. I knew I'd fall, so I was, I'm quite selfish and spoiled. And everyone just accepting me and just letting me do my own thing and no one judging me or saying, you can't do that, you shouldn't do that. And everyone just let me do it. And I... And, I... What, and similarly, what was your lowest point then? Um, I miss my sister. She's having a baby. I miss my mum and dad. Um, I was in the house for my birthday. I um, was quite upset. Um, and because I love my family, my sisters, leaving my friends and coming in here, I, I've done this for myself and I got this just by me doing it from, from knowing, helping me. And I was very shocked and I, I'm chuffed that every, everyone is here supporting me. They and I, are so supportive. I never thought. Now listen, there are all the other housemates. Give them a wave. Yay! Hey guys! The other housemates. Now, listen, I want to reunite you with two very special friends. Okay. Two very, very special friends. Uh -huh. um, and the person that's going to uh, bring them on is your old mate from the house, Bubble! Bring it up! Have some of that! Say the thing. Come here, mate. I'm okay. Uh, Sorry to be there. It's all right, sweetheart. Mr. Mr. Cow. Cow, everyone! Mr. Cow. There's, a, there's one more task Big Brother asked me to do. To what get Mr. Bear from? back, they want to see you waltz one more time. With who? Who do I waltz? I'm going to have to pick these up. Okay. You're going to have to carry those. Who am I waltzing somehow. with? You are waltzing with the Bubba! Bubba! Here we go. Are you ready? Here we go. Are you ready for the twist? Under you go. Okay. I don't believe it. Ryan, don't believe what it. are you going to do with the 70 grand? Um, I don't know. I'm probably... Spend it! Yes! Spend it! OK, listen, I want to just show you, because so you can see something tangible. You have won £70,000. Uh -huh. Let's just watch it going into your account. Uh, is it going in? It's going in It's going to go in right now. Sort code. Put passcode. Seven... Yeah. Relax. Relax. You do. You do. Not worried about, Not worried stuff, about that stuff now.
explain it or, or, or defend it or, or okay. take it back. OK, I'll take it back. Right, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Evil demons! Demons! demons. 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 demons.